Hi, I'm Kate or Kate Loves Makeup. Today I want to do a get ready with me because it's been a couple of years. Um, so yeah, um, it's also like a get to know me get ready with me because I feel like I went from like 30 subscribers to 600 something. So I feel like a lot of people have no idea who I am. Um, they mostly see my shorts, which is fine, honestly, because I know that short videos are much more popular than long videos. Um, I'm going to prime my eyes with the Fenty Beauty Concealer in 110. Um, so yeah, so I am 24 years old. I do this as a hobby on the side. I work for state government, which is kind of an interesting interesting gig um the palette i'm using is this custom palette from unhidden beauty co that i made and of course i made peach colors <laughs> because when don't i use peach colors um so i'm gonna just dip into that while i talk i'm not good at these ones because i don't really know what people want to know about me so i don't know like if you guys have questions please leave them in the comments and I would love to answer them. Um, I, let's see, what else is there? I've been doing this for five years, six years now. I started um, this, I started this in college, my first year of college. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna become a beauty guru <laughs> because I saw so many people doing it and I was like, you know, it would be really fun as a good way of like stress relief especially because I was in nursing school at the time and it really was a good stress relief because I could do my makeup not do anything else like I just focused on my makeup and it would take away from that stress of nursing school because I wasn't focused on my grades I wasn't focused on what I needed to be studying I was just focused on the makeup so I kind of found that it was a calming thing for me which is really cool because I think when I started it I was mostly in it because I was like oh I would love to get free makeup from brands that would be so fun um because that's like what I saw the beauty community as and now it's more like this is like my mental health break this is what I do to have like time to myself um yeah, that's why, that's kind of why I started my page. It was originally for not great purposes, but now here we are. Um, if you want to know any of these shades in this palette, I don't know if they're sold on the website anymore. So I can like, I'll list the shades in the description in the order they're used. But I'm not, I'll have to look before I post it and see if they're even, if they're even um, in stock because this was created oh my god how many years ago like two years ago yeah i've had this for two years don't judge me this is my this is like a project pan update too because this is my pan that palette for the rest of the year and possibly next year because it's a custom palette so nobody can buy it but this is what i use on like a day-to-day -day basis um if i'm doing makeup like to go out i don't use my pile of palettes that I have over here because I've been trying to use different um different pan that palette like different pan items not pan that palette sorry I've been trying to use different pan items because I want to get through some of my makeup that's another thing about me I really really enjoy the panning community and the makeup community because I like this year and last year I really got into like more sustainable beauty um, because I realized I was using so much stuff and like then I would get rid of it immediately and so I've been trying to like find products that I like so I put them in pan rotation to see if I like them um, and if I don't like them it's it's basically like okay well I learned that I can give it away to somebody else who's gonna use it. Um, I'm using this Merit Mascara. I was gifted this for a TikTok campaign. That's another thing I, like, never thought I'd be working with brands like Merit 
and even though I'm like not necessarily really working with them I'm still excited that they chose to send me stuff for TikTok um because my TikTok's pretty small and we have 600 followers on TikTok um so that was like a very I want to say I had like 500 followers on TikTok at the time too and they reached out to me maybe less so <clears throat> I definitely like took a chance on a smaller creator, which I really appreciate. Okay, base. I'm gonna go in with this Milk Hydro Grip Primer. This is also in my pan, pan stuff. Um, it's like almost done. I'm very excited. I'm also gonna be filming another video after this, uh, the 2022 favorites because it is November. I know it's early November. Um, by the time you're watching this, it'll probably be like mid-November <laughs> because, knowing me, I will not edit it by that, by the early November stage. I mean, maybe. I've been kind of really busy with the work. I almost said school. I'm not in school anymore. I graduated. That's another thing. I graduated college. I got a bachelor's degree in psychology. So there's another little fact about me. Um, yeah, I graduated in June of this year, so I'm very much new to the working situation. I mean, like, not new to, like, working in general, but, like, new to the full-time, like, 9 to 5. Um, because I'm not, I didn't do 9 to 5. Um, I'm gonna be using the Bare Look Tint, um, by YSL. I got this in a Octoly thing. They're now Skeepers, which is the worst name ever. Um, I got this on an Octoly thing, and I didn't realize they weren't cruelty-free when I, like, ordered it, and so... Yeah, I'm still trying to use this up. And I think it's on its last leg. I think. Oh, yeah. Okay, well, that's done. Just finished that one. Cool. Now I get to move on to a different foundation. Um, I've been using that one for months. So I'm very... I'm very excited to move on to a different foundation. Um, what else is there about me? Let's see. I am really not into fashion. Like I know that a lot of people in the beauty community are also into fashion. I am personally not because especially as a plus sized woman, it's very very hard to find things that fit me especially in like a fashionable like I can't go and buy like Princess Polly um outfits that some girls like can also can we talk about how like the plus size fashion community like rocks for being able to style things and find things because I am so lazy that I wear the same business casual clothes to work every day and I don't even try and then I also when I'm at home or like going out wear like leggings and a t-shirt so props to them for that um again i'm using the fenty beauty concealer in 110 to conceal my under eyes uh let's see what else is there about me i like playing video games i haven't in a really long time just because i've been so busy with work like this is the first time i've sat down to film a youtube video in months I want to say like four months I know my last one was my full face of merit which was really fun but nobody really watches the longer videos so I know that a lot of people didn't see it um okay I'm going in with this Becca bronzer this is in Bali sands I'm almost done with this bronzer I'm very close um I had to repress it because it was getting some hard pan and was getting so hard to pick up with a brush and I was like, I'm not gonna waste this product. Like, I'm gonna use it, I'm gonna finish it out. Um, so here we are with me trying to finish it out because I have no self-control and I like to buy things or I get gifted things and I'm like, okay, now what do I do with this other bronzer that I've been like trying to finish for the longest time? Um, I'm also not putting on powder because after this, I will most likely be taking this look off because I'm going to a book club meeting for my friend. I'm very excited. Um, yeah, she invited me to a book club. Okay. I'm also not going to wear lashes for this. Mostly because I feel like this looks doesn't really need lashes. It's like super cute on its own. 
I think it's super cute on its own. I don't know about other people. Um, I'm going to go back into that palette and just take the darker brown shade that I had. Um, what else is there about me? Yeah, I like video games. I play Overwatch. I haven't played in a very long time, but if you ever want to play a video game with me, let me know. I hate that like face that I make when I do it. <sighs> Whatever. Doesn't matter. There we go. Um Yeah, I don't there's not much else to me. I like to read. I'm a very big reader. I got back into reading this year. I got like really into romance novels this year because of a friend. So you can blame them for that one. <laughs> Next, I'm going to go in with this Tower 28 Beach Please tint. This is in Magic Hour. Also, in my pan rotation because it's a cream blush and I need to finish it. Although, I think I need to rotate in a new cream blush. Because I'm, like, not using my other ones as frequently as I should be. I mean, I try to when I'm doing, like, Instagram looks, but... It's not as frequent as it should be is what I'm is what I'm finding um, and then highlight I'm gonna go into the Fenty Beauty highlight which I'm also panning yeah so let's see what else is there about me hmm I don't know, yeah, like makeup wise, I tend to do softer looks. And if I do colorful looks, it tends to be like a monochromatic colorful look. Oh yeah, this is the Gerard Cosmetics Lip Pencil in Sugar and Spice. It's getting so small, like let's compare it to a different lip liner. Look at that. She's getting used. She's almost done. Oh, I forgot to do my brows. That's another thing I hate brows because I'm like not good at them this is the elf plumping lip gloss in mocha twist which also has like this much left I'm very it'll be my first lip product I've ever panned so very excited for that um what else is there let's think so reading video games I really enjoy um like purchasing makeup and like reviewing it on my own time i don't really do a lot of reviews on here i probably should because i feel like oh that was a shop miss a slim brow in taupe yeah taupe and then this is the nyx cosmetic tinted brow mascara and blonde um i don't do a lot of reviews on here because i find it hard to like remember throughout the day i also don't wear makeup to the office um I just am lazy. Yeah, I don't wear makeup to the office. That's that's a fact about me. Anyways, um, this is the final look. Yeah, I'm not doing lashes because I'm lazy and don't care. <laughs> I also really enjoy spending time with my friends. Um, that's like mostly what I do on my off days. Like that's what I do when I am have the day off. Yeah. I'm a Scorpio, Scorpio, Sun, Aries, Moon, Cancer, Rising, in case you're into astrology. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Bye.